going on fellas welcome back to the channel man it's your boy and we're back playing some more of marvel future fight for this one we're actually going to be finally finally be tier 2ing gambit a lot of you guys over the past week or so have been asking when are you going to finally tier 2 gambit today is the day we're going to tier 2 gambit in this video and then we're also going to be using him in world boss ultimate to have a little bit of fun with him because i know a lot of you guys want to see how amazing his dps is however keep in mind my gambit is far from completed i don't have any urus on him yet i still have the same crappy obelisk that i had on him before well it's not that crappy but it can be significantly better right all i have is the gears at 20 but the build is exactly the same as i've been using because i want to see just how much more damage i can get out of him just by giving him his tier 2 and keeping everything else the same however i will invest quite a lot in gambit once i have a good feel of how much of a damage boost we're getting from the tier 2 passive really looking forward to seeing just how much more damage we can get out of the 20 percent chain hit and at 30 whoo that whopping 30 percent guaranteed crit rate however before we jump in boys i got a little bit of a surprise for you guys man i got three more legendary booty boxes okay these things been dropping for me pretty consistently however the rewards have not always been that kind i've gotten two premium comic cards so far and I'm really hoping that from this three right here, I can get another premium comic card or I can get a CTP of energy or a CTP of destruction. Really, really hoping we can get something cool today and then we can jump right into having a little bit of fun with Gambit. Let's see what's inside these boxes first and then we'll get into the gameplay. Come on. Woo, wow. A million gold right there. Wow. Woo, oh, ooh. Come on. One more box, please. CTP, CTP, CTP of energy. Come on. CTP of energy, CTP of energy. Where are you? Come on. Ah! At least it's better than rank one, black antimatter. Like, oh, damn, that sucks. That sucks. Those are going to be useful for ranking up uniforms and stuff. Like, sure a rank 5 black antimatter that's a freaking ton of gold i'm saving right there and we got a rank 3 as well so it's not bad but i really want a ctp so badly man anyways all right we're gonna tier 2 gambit and then we're gonna jump right into having a little bit of fun with him in case you guys are wondering how much it cost me overall to build my gambit i actually used a six star mega rank up ticket on him when i got him and then i spent 440 x genes to get his gears all to 20 okay it took me 22 days to max out my gambit and get him to where he is right now so in case you guys are wondering that's what it's probably going to cost you now i'm going to use a ticket on him because i don't have enough of his x genes left over and i'm probably going to just use one of these because i have 16 of them so let's go ahead and do that here we go tier 2 gambit yeah that royal flush let's see how big of a difference it makes for us boys let's take a look at his stats his energy attack isn't really that high only 14,000, but that chain hit and the guaranteed crit gonna be pretty nasty all right this is what the stats look like not really much of a change but we're gonna jump into world boss ultimate and we're gonna put him up against corvus and we're gonna try and see how high i can clear with my gambit using no strikers since he has insane amount of dps i want to test him without any strikers but i will run him with double support right so we start off at stage one run him with double support see how fast we can get corvus down into his second phase so we'll go with ghost panther and valkyrie that should be fine let's see how much damage we can get out of this guy Hopefully he can just one shot this guy with the fifth skill. Let's see what it looks like. Woo! Okay. Safe to save the say stage one is way too easy. Let's try stage 10. Let's see if this guy stays alive long enough for all the cards to come out of the deck. 
This is actually funny. Three seconds, this guy was dead. That is funny. Let's go. 10. Wow, okay. Even 10 is too easy. All right. Let's go 15. We're going to go up in increments of five and see how high we can go with them. Yo, the damage is just insane, guys. All right, so this guy finally survived. 15. Oh, wow. Oh, I thought he was going to go. Ah, okay. Ah, die. Okay. 18 seconds. That is still way too easy. Let's go 20. That's actually crazy. There's characters in the game that even with the strongest strikers and double support, they'll struggle. <laughs> Woo! But this guy's just melting, bro. Alright. I know you're gonna jump. Yeah, do your thing. Here we go. Now hold this. It's crazy that this is not even with the CTP. This is just a regular crappy four-star obelisk. Oh my goodness. Not even 30 seconds, bro. That's insane, bro. Like, I want to see TP so badly, even though he's going to have way more crit damage than he needs. Because I feel like the extra chain hit would just make so much more of a difference. Oh my goodness. Alright. 25. Two bars? Two bars. Almost two and a half bars. Okay. No. Oh, that was close. We almost got clipped. Teleport. I know you're going to do your thing. Yeah, yeah. Hold it. Yep. It's a guaranteed two. And I would say a quarter of a bar every time. That's strange. What happened there? Ah, the summon. Woo! Nice try. Nice try, buddy. Yeah, not even a minute for 25. That's crazy, bro. All right, let's see 30. All right, boys. Stage 30. This is like the maximum for some of the best speed characters in the game. Stage 30. Let's see if Gambi can kill this guy in a minute or less for the first phase. Get out of here. With your stupid okay Ooh. you know i could try to hit him with the fifth while he's doing that but i have to be really really fast Woo. the only downside with gambit is you can't take damage at all ah that sucked I gotta stay away from this guy. I could use the third skill, but I'm just not gonna use it. I just wanna use the fifth and see if just the fifth. Woo! That was close. That was close. Yo, these <laughs> get off me, you stupid minions. I just wanna see if we're just using the fifth skill. Nah, we can't do it in a minute. If I had a CTP. Definitely. Or even if it was just a little bit, if I wasn't messing up <laughs> by using the fifth skill while this guy was going in an iframe, then definitely. All right, so 30. And we have this guy into his next phase in what, a minute and 16 seconds? That's crazy, guys. <laughs> Holy shit. That is crazy. Let's go up to 35. Let's go up to 35 here. All right, let's see how long it takes us to kill him the first time on stage 35.
Woo! A full bar with just a fifth, even on 35. That's strange. How come I... I'll hit him with the three there. I wasted the proc. It is what it is. It's weird. I did way more damage the first time than I did the second time. And I'm trying to figure out why that was. Not sure if it's because... Well, I think it's because he got more dodge. Let's see. Hmm. Do not I for... Ah, uh, you bastard. Nice try. You bastard yo when you're playing gambit you have to unlock your inner usain bolt because <laughs> you're doing bear running guys imagine if your characters in future fight had a stamina bar gambit would need the most amount of stamina <laughs> for how much running you need to do with them yo where is this guy? I don't even... Ooh! That was my bad. That was my bad. That was my bad. I ran into that. So even on 35, this is a joke. Wow. Oh my goodness. Let me go up to 40. 40. 40. See, it's going to get difficult here because there's three different status effects. But all I'm really checking for is damage. If he has enough damage to complete the stage because if he can kill him the first time in under two minutes he definitely has the dps all right let's see if we have the damage to complete stage 40 with no strikers <laughs> that's actually crazy this is actually insane right now guys if he pulls this off like he will be next level stupid in terms of dps and the reason why He's so good here is because his leadership just synchronizes so well with the stage because what makes this stage really difficult besides the bleed damage and all the status effects that are in here. Wow, this guy. Where, where did all those cards go, bro? Anyways, it is the fact that Corvus has a ton of dodge. But because Gambit hits so many times, bro, stop following me and go in your next phase, you bastard. Anyways. Because Gambit has 50% ignored dodge for his leadership and he hit so many times and the all defense down and the chain hit, he's just built for this. Stop running up on me, bro. You don't want to pull up on me, dog. Don't make me have to go savage mode on you. Don't, don't try pulling up on me, dog. Anyways, I'm just going to use the fifth skill and see if we have the dps to push him down into his next phase oh this guy teleported on me <laughs> he's like you're talking all that shit over there i'm gonna put you in your place yo 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 i think we i think if i gave him urus he could definitely get off get off my back bro he could definitely do stage 40 without strikers that's my goal now we're actually gonna try to build him up get off my back i gotta kill these little insects because <laughs> they're taking all the damage damn it Woo! This is not good. This is not good. I don't even know where to go. I'm surprised I have not got hit by a single. Like I said, hit. Wow. English? Do you even? Anyways, I'm surprised I haven't got hit by a single blade twister. So, two minutes and 25 seconds to kill him the first time at stage 40. That's with no strikers. That is insane, guys. That is literally faster than some of the strongest characters in the game using some of the strongest characters as strikers. That is insane. I barely have anything invested in this guy. 
Like, I'm sure I could come here, put some strikers in this, and do stage 40, no problem. But I'm actually going to work on him a little bit more. We're going to give him some Urus, and we're going to try to see how high we can go without the help of strikers and without a CTP. Just a basic obelisk, the same one. But we're going to end this one off right here. Let me know what else you guys want to see with Gambit. I'm going to work on him a little bit more. I would work on him in this video, but I don't want to make this one super long. Make it like 30 minutes long. I don't want to do that because y'all probably not going to watch that anyways. But leave your thoughts in the comments. Let me know some of the things you guys want to see with Gambit because I'm honestly very, very, very impressed. Like I knew his damage was going to be really good. I knew keeping him alive was going to be the hard part of the character. But I was definitely not expecting his damage to be this good while my build is basically like mediocre. Like there's barely nothing in there. My gambit is what, 3,000 in the world? And that's only because he's a premium character and not that many people have him. That's not because he's built all that well. Take a look at that, right? <laughs> oh my goodness. Look at that. Ooh, rank. Garbage. Custom gear rank. Uh, I so said. Oh yeah, I don't remember if I show you guys that. It's not awakened at all right so there's so much more i could do to make this guy significantly stronger you mean to tell me if i make this iso set fully awakened and i gave him a ctp of energy and gave him Uru, this guy could probably take down like stage 50 without strikers that is insane that is insane just saying that out loud blows my mind cables are dps god and i don't think my level 70 cable could out dps gambit i really don't think he could that's actually insane and it has a large part to do because of the fact that this guy has the damage reduction sorry the all defense down like this thing because it stacks all the way up to 60 percent and it lasts for 10 seconds oh my goodness this is one of the reasons why his damage is just insane and even though I have so much crit damage on him already and giving him a CTP of energy would be a massive waste of stats and y'all already know I don't like to waste stats. If I had an extra CTP of energy, I would give it to him just to see the ridiculous level of damage I could get out of him. Like just out of curiosity. So if any of you guys have an extra CTP of energy laying around and you're a big fan of Gamut and you want to see some ridiculous clears in War Boss Ultimate, drop it on him. Drop it on him. Have fun with him. Because seriously, that's what I would do if I was in your position. Seriously. Insane DPS. Oh my goodness. I'm scared to say that Cable might be out DPS by gambit i'm scared to say that you mean to tell me that there is potentially a new dps god what you mean to tell me that once gambit is at level 70 he may very well be able to out dps cable what is this real life <laughs> oh my goodness anyways boys leave your thoughts in the comments man i'm rambling at this point i'm actually just dumbfounded literally dumbfounded shit stage 40 no strikers Woo! <laughs> gambit, 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 my guy. Goddamn.